How you doing YouTube viewer? Thanks for viewing this video. This is another Ole Pop Cherry Vanilla. Oops, sorry, my finger is in the way. A sparkling tonic, 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters. No GMOs. Plant fiber. Supports digestive health. Is plant powered micro approved. Here are the ingredients it's your barcode if you need it. And I just I did just take this out of the refrigerator, so it is uh, cold. My other one that I did a review on, the uh, strawberry vanilla, was not that great. It was a negative 10 out of 10. Here's the uh, stored refrigerator, and then their little story. No added sugar. Vegan, please recycle. Okay, let me go ahead and turn the uh, camera around so you can see my ugly face and uh, my review of it. Okay, so we are going to open up this can of cherry vanilla ole pop. Let's get the camera there. Every time I open it up, there is always a mist. So let's see if there's a mist on this one. Yeah, slight mist. Alright. Do it like a wine tasting thing. Take a sip of it. Or actually, smell it first. Sip of it. Then squish it around. Then uh, I'm going to finish the can. So, there's acidic taste or acidic smell of it. It's trying to smell like cherry vanilla or cherry Coke, cherry Pepsi. doesn't smell like it's supposed to let's put it that way uh, one thing I have been having trouble with these Ole Pops is that uh, there is an aftertaste or sorry a beginning taste so as soon as that you put it to your lips and start drinking that there's a taste to it I don't know why uh, this one's refrigerated it is sweating because of uh, where I am but first drink Sure, if you guess, let me lift the camera. See the uh, damn, uh, where is it? All right, different cut co the color of it, so it is a uh, a reddish color. So, uh Taking a sip of it did try to taste like a cherry coke, um, but there's a, a, just that weird taste of it. I have no clue what it is, but just like if you check out any of the other videos of this same product, um, I drink sweet tea, very sh light sugar, um, water I drink every once in a while as long as it's flavored. But this, I'm just having too much trouble drinking. And I've had plant-based uh, stuff before, and it's just not, this is not good. Even this one's not that good. Oh. 
Oh, man. I gotta finish it, even though it tastes bad. It doesn't even taste like cherry. Vanilla. Tastes more like the vanilla extract than uh, what it's supposed to be. Just like the last video, I get I'm gonna have to force myself to drink this thing. I'm gonna have to have my iced tea ready to wash out the taste. Alright. There's a little more than a half can left. do not taste and I love cherries I love strawberries Ugh. there's no taste of that actually this is the one that I feel like I'm gonna toss my cookies Only a little bit left. This will be a last drink. Thank God it's going to be a last drink. My review of this is negative 10 out of 10. I would never buy this again. There's a case for like $31 or $41 for this. If you join their club, then it's a little cheaper. But Philip DeFranco's who one who uh, was advertising for it, and I will not take his recommendation again for this thing. Last drink. Sorry, there's one little. All right, all gone. <laughs> Walmart tea, even though it has 30 grams of sugar, wash the taste out of, of that out of my mouth. Made the tea taste bad. And again, I'm gonna say it. I've had plant based, I've had tonic water before. And this is probably this and the uh. Strawberry vanilla. Oh god. That them two were nasty. Completely nasty. So thanks for watching my review. Ugh. Excuse me. I do have to recover off of drinking that. Oh man. Alright. Thanks for watching. Uh, I do have another orange squeeze and a ginger lemon of Ole Pop, and then I'll be done with that cans of soda, which I will never order again. Uh, if somebody is trying the the stuff, there is an orange cream 
that I would like to try, but I'm not going to spend 30 to 40 bucks for another case again to get it. Or even any amount of money to buy that again. Because the only ones that are somewhat good was the classic root beer, but still I'd rather drink the cheap brand from Dollar General, Dollar Tree, Family Dollar, Walmart. And the same thing with the uh, cola. I mean, there is so-so, but there's just that beginning taste and a little bit of aftertaste. But these, this one, oh god, you can, you kind of see my face. I can't make that shit up. So, thanks for watching. Have a great day. See you on the next one.